Welcome to the Burning Earth Project, real-time analysis of our rapidly changing climate system. This is your host, Gerard Spring, coming to you from the North. Human economic activity has pushed the biosphere to the brink of collapse. On Burning Earth Radio, we emphasize a sober mindset and focus on the physics of what's going on with Earth's rapidly changing climate systems. The issue of abrupt climate change is real, and a number of issues threaten us physically, psychologically, and socially. Elevated levels of greenhouse gases such as carbon dioxide, methane, carbon monoxide, and others have changed the chemistry of Earth's atmosphere, generating rapid, protracted warming of the planet. The chronically higher temperatures are reflected in the thinning and retreat of the sea ice reserves in the Arctic Mediterranean, as well as terrestrial cryosphere reservoirs such as the Greenland Ice Sheet, the Ross Ice Shelf, and the Great Antarctic Ice Sheets. Migration and weakening of atmospheric circulation patterns is also occurring, bringing aberrant weather to many locations within the mid-latitudes, sub-Arctic, and high Arctic, being particularly affected. There's also the issue of precipitation acidification due to particulates and sulfates emitted from unregulated production sources and industrial sources. Most of the Earth's heat is stored in the oceans, and as the oceans heat up, we're seeing alteration of marine circulation patterns such as the Gulf Stream, effects on thermohaline circulation patterns, and other anomalous El Nino-like features developing in the Pacific. Additionally, elevated levels of CO2 are generating ocean acidification, which has a profound effect on marine biomes, coral reefs, and pelagic fish populations. Along with this, we cannot ignore the ongoing research and implementation of geoengineering schemes, which aim to technologically mitigate our growing climate emergency, such as solar radiation management, stratospheric aerosol injection, artificial ice nucleation, marine cloud brightening, ocean iron fertilization, and carbon sequestration schemes. What do we have to lose? The beauty of nature is endless and inspiring, and we have lost touch. Subscribe for documentary film footage of the elegance of nature and a detailed analysis of our impact on Earth's climate systems. You can also follow me on Twitter at Gerard Spring for the latest updates on the Burning Earth Project. Thank you so much for listening.